So hello guys, today we're gonna talk about um, install a uh, SSL certificate on an um, exchange server. Um, this is the same for the, the new uh, 2019 exchange and for the 2016, the updated one. So, <clears throat> uh, I hope you guys enjoy, I hope I'll be able to, to help you. And if I do, please uh, subscribe the channel. It's very important for me. It's the way you have to support me and support my work. So for a start, I'm going to show you here. The plus doesn't have uh, now the, the certificate. You, you need to do by command. So the, the, the old days you, you were able to do by the, the GUI, but now you just you just have to do it by by powershell so they they give some indication here i tried it but uh, i was not able to do how it's saying here so i research a different command so i have the command here i will uh, pass to you guys uh, and it worked for me and um, i hope it uh, work with you as well so let me open the, um, the PowerShell here. And let me open the, the notepad. So I will paste the command here that I used. I changed some, um, some parts of the command for, for applied to my reality. So you need to, to change these parts here okay for for what you need after this you just uh, copy paste the command okay all right not liking the vision part a lot of commands just change recently so it doesn't matter i will just take all of this off and it's okay you can do it this way so you have the the certificate here you need to copy this you will need this later so copy it whatever you it suits you better. I will put on the notepad. Okay. So perfect. Now you need to go to to a entity that produce um, certificate. In my case, I will use zero SSL. If you guys like zero SSL, I will leave the link. It's my personal link. So if you want to support me, you can use my link. And, and that will support me and I thank you guys so here on uh, on zero SSL you have a lot of different uh, certificates you can ask for a, a wild card you can ask for a, a some whatever I will do the free version that you don't have to pay just 19 days here you change for pay, paste the CSR and you paste the, the value that you had before. Just need to, to do ne next. I will do this one, it's the free. As you can see, you have more. Now, probably he will ask me to verify my domain. Okay. I will verify my domain through DNS. Give me, give me a little bit, guys. I will have to paste this on my DNS. You see how it's done. If you needed to do it on your, on your end, you see how how I did it. It's simple. It's a C name. It's just copy paste the values. Going here to my DNS. Okay. 
to see name I had one here before I just uh, need to to edit this Now I will apply, this will take like uh, a minute or not so much to replicate, you, you need to wait a little bit to, uh, to the replication, some, some servers take more time than others, mine it's very fast so I just give it uh, a minute and uh, he, will, um, he will replicate. After we have the, the certificate, we have to import the, the certificate that the site, the, the zero SSL will gonna generate and to, to import, we'll try by GUI, but I have, I think that we have to be uh, to, to PowerShell as well. Don't worry, we're gonna, gonna do together until the end. So it should uh, be here, okay. This is the GUI, GUI one that I think it will not work, but let's see. Okay. See, it's here, the, the certificate is here, it's pending, uh, um, pending uh, the request this is what we're gonna finish let me validate here because it already passed some time okay it was validate Perfect. Let's download the certificate. Okay. Just have to extract here. Okay, perfect. The certificate is this one. Let's see if we can do it here, but I, I really doubt it. Yeah, it's not possible. We have to do it by PowerShell. So let's open PowerShell, and we will use. Okay. Just a second, guys. Okay, I don't. I don't need the password because I didn't put any password on my file. I just need this part. Oh, because. Uh, Wait a little bit. This is because it's a uh, Internet Explorer, so it doesn't work on Internet Explorer. Let me open here on, on my side. So, give me a second. Just 
just copying the the link to to my computer so I can modify this and use this link okay there you go so this is the command that we're gonna use we need to change the path And now I don't have a ser, I have a CRT, I believe so. So let me check that. Okay, yes, it's a CRT. There's no problem, you can use a CRT. So just copy this. And change here to CRT perfect and this is the command that I will want to use just paste paste here and there you go it uh, have completed the um, the request if we're gonna check here on um, on our ex admin center you see that it's valid now and uh, that's it guys now we gotta we can open this will uh, work for external access so you have to to, to go in my case it's mail dot my domain slash and I can uh, I can show you so here you have to to change to to yeah, yeah sorry uh, because um, this is an EIS um, certificate so after this you can open this and as I was telling you that's my domain and the certificate is valid and it's it's done so thank you guys I hope you like it and uh, please subscribe the channel Nice.